In my last video, I show you how to create multi-level dependent dropdown in Google Sheet. But the limitation of those methods, you cannot add or delete the row in between your sheet. I developed my second video on which you can easily add or delete the row in between your sheet. But the limitation of those methods, you will create helper column in each of the tip. Now in this video, I'm going to show you alternative method to create multi-level dependent dropdown in a single column. For example, I have this drop down table on which I have the continent, I have the country and I have the city information and I create this dependent drop down in a single column. For example, I click here and I simply type EUR or PE. Now you can see the list will filter out for a Europe. If I simply type comma space and simply type G, now my list is filtered out for a Germany only and I can easily select my option. So how we can create this dependent drop down I will show you each and everything briefly in this video. Consider I have the sheet on which I have the continent country city information. The first thing I need to create the fourth helper column. I will simply name it let's say combine and here I will type a very simple formula by row open parenthesis select the range in this case I will define ABC column. So I will select all of the three column and I will remove the last digit because I want end reference to be infinite. Simply hit comma, lambda, open parenthesis. What is the name? In this case, I will define the name, let's say X. And now I will type a very simple formula, text join, open parenthesis. What is the delimiter? In this case, my delimiter is comma space quotation mark again and for the ignore parameter i will simply define true and for the text i will define x since already i define x as a a b c column close parenthesis for text join lambda and by row and simply hit enter now you can see we have a single cell formula but it combine all of the result for continent country and city the next tip I will go to sheet 1 and simply click on B2, simply hit Control shift down arrow key, Control backspace key to move to the ecto cell again which is B2, simply click on data, data validation, click add rule, drop down from a range, select data range, click here and now simply go to drop down table, click on D2, drag the mouse down and simply remove the last digit and simply hit ok now you can see drop down is almost ready but scroll a little bit to the bottom side and click on advanced options scroll a little bit more and in this case i want display style arrow format simply hit turn and if i simply go to sheet one now my drop down is ready if i simply click here and i simply type asia hit comma now you can see my list is filtered out for asia only space and if i simply type japan now you can see all of the city related to japan has been shown to me and i can easily select the option i want so this is how we can create multi-level dependent drop down in a single column now the benefit of this method is you can easily create duplicate copy of this sheet and the drop down will still work I hope you learned something useful from this video. If you have any specific question, please write in comment. And if you like the video, please share the concept so that other people can take benefit from this video. Thank you so much.